Today Paul here down by the river again on Saturday morning with all the runners passing by. But I'm just uh, looking at Psalm 103. Um, from verse 13. As a father shows compassion on his children, so the Lord shows compassion to those who fear him. For he knows our frame, he remembers that we are dust. As for man, his days are like grass, and he flourishes like a flower in the field. For the wind passes over it and it's gone and its place remembers us no more. But the steadfast love of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him and his righteousness to children's children. To those who remember his covenant and remember to do his commandment. The Lord has established his throne in heaven and his kingdom rules over all. Bless the Lord, O you angels, you mighty ones who do his word, obeying the voice of his word. Hallelujah. Just look at these runners out every Saturday morning running five kilometres, exercising their bodies. But you know, in James 4.14 it says we are but a mist, a vapour that soon disappears like the flower in the field that flourishes. The wind blows over it and it's gone and our place remembers us no more. But he says be steadfast and immovable. He says that in uh, 1 Corinthians 15, um, verse 58. Let's have a look at that. 1 Corinthians 15, over the page, verse 58. Here we are. Therefore, my beloved brothers, be steadfast, immovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, knowing that in the Lord your labour is not in vain. We can labour at lots of things, but when you labour in the Lord, your labour is not in vain. For the Lord has the words of eternal life. And so our work in the Lord goes on into eternity. You know, whether we are teaching someone about the kingdom of heaven or whether we're leading someone to know Jesus, that's labour in the Lord. And uh, it's not in vain. It's not vanity. So a lot of our time is short. I'll be 80 this year, but it just seems to have gone like that, like the mist, gone in the morning when the sun rises. And uh, so good to know that Jesus is with me and that I will be with him in eternity. When I'm out of this body, when I leave this body, I'll be with Jesus in eternity. That's something that I firmly believe. I know where I'm going and I'd love you to come with me. So all you need to do there is call on the name of the Lord and you will be saved. And get into his word to learn what he has to teach us about life in eternity. There you are, a little word from the Lord down here by the park run on the river. Um, you get into the word yourself and let the word of God get into you. And just look at these people, running, 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 children, people with their dogs, people with their pushers, and they're all out checking their bodies and seeing what they can do on a Saturday morning. Bye for now.